This is a thermoelectric cooler. When you connect it to a power source, it starts getting cold. My meter is showing the temperature going down. But there's one problem. If you check the temperature of the other side of the cooler, it is getting hot quickly. After a few minutes, the heat from the hot side will warm up the cold side. To solve that problem, you would use a fan. I have a fan attached to the hot side of my cooler to remove more heat. And please don't use hot glue to attach fans to heat sinks. In use, don't expect it to last longer than a few minutes. With the cooler running at 7.4 volts and the fan removing heat, the temperature of the cold side is staying close to 11 degrees Celsius. Or approximately 51 degrees Fahrenheit. But I want it to get colder. So I will be using a 30 watt rated blower powered by an RS360 brushed DC motor. The air blows out of my blower at over 40 miles per hour. That means I will push tropical storm force winds through my heatsink. Here I have the heatsink hot glued to the exit of the blower. I don't know how well this will work, but let's give it a try. This blower is cooling more effectively. The temperature is less than 10 degrees Celsius. It seems like the lowest temperature we will get is 7.2 degrees Celsius or approximately 45 degrees Fahrenheit. So, a bigger fan will cool more effectively. If you want to see more fun experiments, please hit the like button, and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any new uploads.